Hello and welcome to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet. And today we have a little look back, a little rewind for this year what happened with whiskey.com. .com, whiskey.com was founded 2014 or bought 2014 from us and we founded a YouTube channel and a website. We relaunched them and yeah, we're now five years active, which is kind of incredible now. Um, and, and during these five years, we pushed the YouTube channel quite a lot and we are now 50,000 subscribers, which is quite a substantial number. If we compare that to the whiskey.de channel, which is now, uh, it was founded in 2007, which should be then 12, 13 years, something like that. And they also have 50,000 users over there in the German channel. So yeah, we are growing quite substantially. What happened on the YouTube channel? There was one setback on the 1st of July. The Whiskey Vision TV cask broke. I rushed and I got a pump. I got uh, containers which were resistant to alcohol and I pumped up all the, the spirit. It is still spirit and saved quite everything. I lost a few liters, so a couple of liters, maybe one gallon or something like that. And got the cask repaired with a wooden lid now. And on the 19th of September, the cask was filled again. And now the cask is two years old. Also on the YouTube channel, I did two tours to Scotland and did a lot of uh, short documentations about the distilleries. So uh, I did one Southern Highland tour, not quite lowland. I think I had one or two lowlanders in there and a Speyside tour. And amongst them were Aberfeldy, Tullibardin, Glengoyne and Glenfarclas and many, many more. So people quite like these uh, short documentations and we will keep doing them. So I will, I'm already planning two new tours uh, during the next year. So watch out for that. Then we have a lot of live tastings. We had one beginners live tasting in December and we had quite a substantial number of themed live tastings, mostly with distilleries, but also we had a Canadian one. We had one with a lot of Irish whiskies and Glendonach, Benriach, Beaumont and many, many more. So I think you quite enjoy these live tastings. So watch out for the next live tastings. Um, then we do also have a new Instagram channel. So the Instagram channel features a lot of pictures from bottles and a few pictures of me at the distillery and other distillery photos. So if you like to flick through pictures, through beautiful pictures or nice whiskey pictures, then keep on, uh, go to the whiskey.com and subscribe to that channel. And in the end of the year, you always think about uh, what you have achieved. And then you think about people who have not achieved that much or people who are much more unfortunate. And what we do is we do charity. So at the end of the year, we always think about the charity and um, um, support charities that we think that are beneficial. Uh, we don't go to many big charities because uh, we've heard a lot of stories about the money being wasted there. So we really, really go into the local charities because we just know these people. We know that they don't uh, spend tons of money. They don't drive Aston Martins and all the other scandals that we've heard of. They just use the money in the right way. So what we all, what we do is uh, we live in the town called Zeesopt and Zeesopt has a, 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 a charity that's called the Zeesopt Südsee and which is the Southern Sea, which we are on the southern end of a, a, a lake. And it's a, a children's home uh, for orphans or neglected children or something like that. And it's a small home for a couple of children and that they get, yeah, a quite good uh, childhood there. Then we have also the Zisabda Romanian Hilfe. This is a charity that goes to Romania. Some people from the town go to Romania and they support um, doctors down there and children who are dis or becoming disabled. There is a phenomenon 
called the uh, the water head and there is uh, water that is being uh, stored in the head or is, is, is a and conglomerating there and if you spend a couple of hundred bucks um, on uh, on in the clinic and you actually drain the water out then the children grow up very very normal so they become very very normal people otherwise they become uh, disabled and really really dumb because the, the the water prevents the brain from expanding and becoming in the normal sized human brain so if you invest a couple of hundred bucks, then there is uh, just one child growing up normally. So uh, think about what you achieved during the last year. Think about if there are any local charities that you can engage. If you don't have any money, maybe you can just work there or help them or anything. So um, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Um, keep, keep on having fun, uh, keep being subscribed and see you in the next year.